चैनल को सब्सक्राइब करें बेल आइकन को दबाएं और पाएं मोस्ट एंटरटेनिंग वीडियोस। हेलो गाइस, यू ऑल आर मोस्ट वेलकम ऑन माय चैनल फन एंड लर्निंग आई एम आकाश श्रीवास्तव एंड टूडेज टॉपिक इज ब्रैक्स लॉ दिस इज द फिगर ऑफ ब्रैक्स लॉ एंड लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड अबाउट दिस फिगर देर इज बट क्रिस्टल कंस्टिट्यूट अ थ्री डायमेंशनल ग्रेटिंग so brax has given a simple interpretation of diffraction pattern obtained by supposing reflection takes place from the various planes in the crystal okay so now let's understand the figure let a narrow beam of monochromatic x rays of wavelength lambda be incident on plane a b and c these are the plane a b and c these are the two x rays x and y they are falling on these planes and reflecting from them moving forward in a crystal at a glancing angle theta this is the theta this is the theta okay the ray xl is reflected from the plane b where is the plane b this is the plane b the ray xl is reflected by plane b and whereas the ray yn is reflected from the plane a c this is the plane a reflected by n that is reflected from plane a moving forward whereas the ray yn is reflected from the plane a if nr and ns are perpendicular drawn from n where is nr where is ns let's see this is nr and this is ns and they both are perpendicular to each other so now moving forward if the ns and nr are perpendicularly drawn from n then the path difference between y and x r the path difference between y and x we will cover it at that will be total to rl plus ls what is the value of rl in this triangle see in this triangle the value of rl will be equal to this nl sin theta and the value of nl is equal to d that is the distance between the planes a b and b c so this will be equal to d sin theta and as the same the ls the value of ls will be also equal to d sin theta so we will just add them and get the value that is 2 d sin theta where d is plane separation nl is equal to d i have shown that and angle r nl is equal to theta is equal to angle snl for constructive pattern this path difference d is equal to integral multiple of lambda so 2d sin theta will be equal to n lambda where n is an integer so the relation is bragg's law which indicates that for a given values of n lambda and d there is reflection only in particular direction theta in other direction there will be destructive interference that is for n बराबर 1 2d sin theta 1 will be equal to lambda and for n बराबर 2 2d sin theta 2 will be equal to 2 lambda and for n बराबर 3 2d sin theta is equal to 3 lambda and it adc this will go continue thank you if you like my video please like my video and subscribe my channel thank you